All right, so we just finished our UI in home screen with horizontal scrolling and also vertical scrolling. And in this part, I will show you how to display the detail of recipes. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so in views folder, we should add a new Swift file with Swift UI view. Name this file recipe detail page or detail view like this and continue first of all we should call our model var recipe equal to our recipe model struct and also we should display for preview to see the result in canvas so click on fix and go to your model and select one of the recipes to display there and i will select this one copy this and paste it in preview recipe model so you can just fix your code lines like this by deleting the space for testing i will display a text called recipe.title to see the canvas preview okay we see the title that's great so before redesigning recipe detail view so let's make the forage when we clicked on one of the recipe to display in detail view i don't use navigation link in this case i prefer to use full screen cover to display the detail of the items like in this example when i click on one of the recipe i just show the recipe detail from full screen cover not navigation link for displaying full screen cover under background ultra theme material under this V stack, write dot full screen cover, and here we should add some variables. So add state variable called selected item or selected recipe, and here call your recipe struct. So here in item, we should call our selected item variable. So just write selected recipe. So for content, you can just click on it and in here identifiable, write recipe in. So for code, just call your recipe detail page and recipe model equal to this recipe we called with selecting item. So go up to recipe cart and add on tab. When user clicked on one of these cards, we will get it the from selected card the recipe model okay when the user clicked on this we will update this selected recipe variable okay so let's test it i will click on this okay i saw my title okay again i will test it so let's click on this one okay it's updating that's great so now we can update our recipe detail view okay so let's open a navigation view there and open scroll view so let's display with vstack so inside vstack first of all i will display my image from recipe dot image name okay we can see our image quickly make it resizable and scale to fit let's give some frames for example max height not width 150 and give it some padding for example 10 also let's give it a shadow color and make it black with some opacity for example 0 0.3 for x.0 and y four we can see some of the shadows also let's make it dark mode select recipe detail view and scheme replace with dark so give another v stack to this image so we can add a background for this right background ultra thin material also let's give it some corner radius maybe 15 and give it some padding okay looks great so let's move on to the text 
for the recipe details text and here just so write recipe dot headline and give it some font with maybe title and make it bold also give some padding with horizontal okay we see this text now but let's make this v stack alignment to leading to see this text on the left screen so now it looks better okay so let's move to other texts so under text headline open new v stack i will open new v stack because if you see on detail page after lunch or headline text i made another area for this information so for this we should have an v stack and make it alignment leading open new v stack again so also make it alignment leading so copy this text you can paste it there so first text instructions give it some font with title 3 maybe and also make it bold give it some padding for vertical so let's display the recipe instructions text and make it font dot body and foreground color that white but let's give some opacity 0 0.7 maybe looks better and let's give some frames for this v stack max height infinity and alignment To top and give it some padding okay looks better right okay so under this v stack we should open new v stack again vertical stack and also make it alignment leading so we should display ingredients and make it font title 3 and also make it bold give some horizontal padding so for ingredients I prefer to display with horizontal scrolling under this text open scroll view and make it horizontal scrolling and make shows indicators to false open lazy edge stack and make it spacing minus 20 so we display with forage and open array write recipe dot ingredients and make it enumerated dot element here just write index first and comma ingredient so let's display the ingredient with text and write ingredient so you see we display the text but we should make it better design so let's give some foreground color white with opacity 0 0.7 and also give it some padding make it 10 and make it background color ultra thin material corner radius 5 so now it looks great but we should give some horizontal padding so go to under this forage give some padding and make it horizontal so now looks great right now you can give some background to this v stack so just find this v stack end and give some frame so make it width infinity and height let's give some height with maybe 500 and let's give some this scroll view frame to fix this issue and make it maybe 100 to display better and make this alignment bottom leading give some background color again I will give ultra thin material so to make it corner radius just on top of this V stack we should add an extension inside view model open new file select suit file and write extensions I will paste my codes and also you can go to my github repository to find this codes and do copy paste for my project so go to recipe detail view again and let's give some corner radius to top of this vista right corner radius 20 
but the corners it is top left and top right so you see it's had just corner radius to top not on bottom so that's it it's finished now but also we can give some background to whole of this full screen cover so for making this find this scroll view tag and go to under that give some background with ultra thin material and let's display a navigation title with recipe dot title okay so let's go back to recipe view and click one of these recipes okay we can make it dark mode with adding this preferred color scheme dark and again click one of these recipes okay looks great everything it works great but now if we want to go back to recipe view home we can't so we should add cancel or close button here right like in my example on right side okay so let's give it that for this go to recipe detail view and go top add this code line environment dismiss var dismiss so go down again under navigation title write navigation bar items so write image system name and write x mark dot circle dot fill you see we display this icon and when user clicked on it this miss so now let's go back to recipe view select one of these items or recipes now we display detail page and click on X mark to close this recipe detail view. So it's working perfectly. Okay, so that was the video. Thanks for watching.